Shalom. First, I'd like to begin by giving all praises and all glory to Yahweh, Rashem Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone World Well. Rest and salutation to the men that push this word in sincerity and in all truth. Brother Howard from GMS Trinidad. Here to do a video through the Spirit of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. And this video is based off of um, free will. You know what I mean? You know, I was having a little conversation with a guy a little way back. You know, and um, just a short lesson that's to bring out the edification. You know, once again. You know, so the first book is the folk of um, Philippians chapter 2 and 13. And basically, it's showing you that there's a power higher than us. You know, that other people may know. And that power is the one who who is in control of everything right you know you can't say that you control your own destiny or whatever the case might be you know there's a there, there, we have any father is the one who who ordains all things if you want it to be bad if you want it to be good if you want it to change just to be an example you know all the power and glory is, is with him you know and we as 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 just dust <laughs> that's the thing we, we are just dust you know we are we, we the lord program you know bashim yashai programs everything you know that is just the next is that's our next delusion to make you feel or to make an individual feel that they they have control over the the, the, the destiny of the case might be you know so the book of philippians chapter 2 and 13 it says for it is god which work it in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure right to do of his good pleasure for it is god which work it in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure now we are in a different translation right the book of philippians chapter 2 and verse 13 it says for it is yahweh which work it in you both in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure right for it is Yahweh which work it Yahweh Bashem Yashai which work it in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure right so we'll compare this here um one sec Right? It says the BB version it says for it is God, it is Yahweh, who is the cause of your desires and of your acts, <laughs> right? For this for his good pleasure. So it clears to share that it's the Lord Yahweh Shim Yashai who is in control. Right? He is the one. <clears throat> He's the one who directs your step. He's the one. Who controls everything you see so it, it has nothing called you're free to do anything right by you saying that yeah yeah or you're independent right because the word independent When they say you have free will, I mean you're independent, right? Free from outside control, and it, it is more or less like you, you do, you're not believe you don't believe that it, that there's a um, there's a God. In other words, 
right because free will is not being dependent on anybody you're free to do whatever you want right you don't have a creator you don't have a supreme being you don't have you know what i mean it says for e, um, easy english it says obey god because he is working in you he is changing you so that you so that you want to obey him right ISV for God is who is producing in you both the desires and the ability to do what pleasures him. Right? So, the yeah, next scripture is right, um, Jeremiah chapter 10 and 23. Jeremiah chapter 10 and verse 23. Jeremiah 10 and 23 says, O Yahweh, I know that the way of man is not in himself. It is not in man that walk it to direct his steps. Right? Now when you compare this, you know, in the English, in the BBE version, it says, O Yahweh, I am conscious that a man's way is not in himself. Man has no power to, of guiding his steps. So how the free will come about? Right? How the free will come about? You see, these are things that the churches teaches that we have free will. Free will. Right? As the scriptures say, hey, um, um Rush Romans 9 who can res- who can resist his will right so by you doing by you thinking you doing something that you came up with is actually his will you doing right it's his will you doing good or bad it, 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 the Lord ultimately is the one who guides everything and that is something you have to understand but the lord can't tempt a man to do bad right but we now know is that the lord is the one who get the glory for everything because satan on the left hand side that is his job ship just say when a man is tempted or see he's tempted of god right no free power freezing So it says, um, easy, easy English, I know, Yahweh, Hashem Yahshai, that you give life to each man, right? Only you can say where he shall walk. Right? No, are they like, are they like, are they reading, the, I compare the, the, the other Bible verses because a lot of people don't read this. They don't read the King James Version because it's hard to understand. Right, so I read in the easy English versions now. So it's clear for you now. It should be clear. Who have ears to hear will hear. And the ISV says, Yahweh, I know that a person's life is not his his to control. Nor does a person establish his way in life. Right? And I don't need to read anymore. Right? Read the book of um, Proverbs 20 24. Proverbs 20 24 it says, Man's going, goings are of Yahweh. How can a man then understand his own way? Hmm. Compare BBE. A man's steps are of Yahweh. How then? May a man have knowledge of his way. Easy English. The Lord decide. The Lord decides the way that a man should go. Nobody knows the way that he should go. As be a man's steps are directed by how? How can a, how can anyone understand his own way? Right. The the NET it says. The steps of a person are ordained by Yahweh. 
so how can anyone understand his own way everything is ordained by the heavenly father right free will is out of the question it has nothing called it has nothing said um calls call um free will right you are controlled by the heavenly father right um proverbs 16 and, and one and I'll pro- proverbs 16 and 9 right proverbs 16 and 1 it says better proverbs no, um yeah proverbs 16 and 1 it says the preparation of the heart in man and the answer of the of the tongue is from Yahweh. It's from Yahweh. All ways, all the ways of a man are clear in his own eyes, right? But Yahweh with the spirit. BBE it says the design of the heart um, amends a man's but the answer of the tongue comes from Yahweh. Easy English. We may have good ideas. Nice. We may have good ideas, but only Yahweh can help you to see the right thing. Okay. It says people do the planning, but the end result is from Yahweh. Right? The plans of the heart belongs to a man, but the answer right, right. Right? Um verse 19. 16 I mean. It says how much 19 it says better is better mm, how do it It says, a man's heart divides the way, but Yahweh directed the steps. Maybe a man may, may make design for his way. I think I read this already. Yeah. 